ever pondered what life would be like on Mars? There's an undeniable allure to the red planet. It's our closest cosmic neighbor that holds any promise for human habitation. Yet, it's a world apart, with conditions that make the harshest of Earth's environments seem like a tropical paradise. But the human spirit thrives on challenges, on pushing boundaries, and Mars represents the ultimate frontier. So despite the obstacles, the dream persists, living on Mars. Now let's dive into what living on Mars would entail. Mars is no picnic site. The conditions are harsh, to say the least. Picture this, a world with a thin atmosphere, where temperatures swing from a midday high that could feel like a spring day on Earth, to a nighttime low that could rival the coldest Antarctic winter. The thin atmosphere, barely 1% of Earth's, would be like living at an altitude of about 22,000 feet, where Mount Everest climbers require oxygen masks to breathe. This meager atmosphere offers little protection from the sun's harmful radiation, a constant invisible threat. And that's not all. Water, the elixir of life, exists mostly as ice, with only traces of it in the thin Martian air. These conditions pose a monumental challenge to human settlers. Living on Mars would mean constant vigilance, ceaseless adaptation and rigorous innovation. So with these challenges, how could humans possibly adapt to life on Mars? Adapting to life on Mars would require human ingenuity at its finest. Picture this, sealed environments, much like airtight bubbles, allowing us to breathe as we would on Earth. These habitats, constructed with advanced materials and technologies, would provide shelter from the harsh Martian climate and cosmic radiation. But what about supplies, you ask? The answer lies in a concept known as in situ resource utilization, or ISRU. This proposes that we use what Mars has to offer, its soil, its atmosphere, its water ice, to create what we need to survive. This could mean growing food in Martian soil or extracting oxygen from the carbon dioxide rich atmosphere. Constructing a new life on Mars is no walk in the park. It's a challenge that will test our limits, but also spur us on to new heights of innovation and adaptation. Though challenging, life on Mars isn't an impossibility. It's a testament to human resilience and our insatiable curiosity. So, we've taken a brief journey through what life on Mars might look like. We've seen the harsh, yet intriguing conditions of the Red Planet. We've grappled with the challenges of constructing sealed habitats and maintaining supplies in such an alien environment. Yet we've also glimpsed at human adaptability, our inherent ability to thrive in the face of adversity. As we continue to reach for the stars, who knows? Someday, Mars might just be another place humans call home.